Welcome to today's show, Jackson 5. We have a great guest in Marquise Lee, the touchdown scoring. Marquise Lee, how you doing today? I'm doing good, how you doing, man? I'm doing all right, man, I'm doing all right. So, first we just want to let the people know, you know, we know you're from LA like I am, but you know, what part of LA, you know, what high school? Uh, I'm originally from Inglewood, California. Okay. Uh, I went to Morningside first. Okay, <laughs> there you go. Uh, crazy school in Inglewood, then uh, I transferred actually to Sarah after that and finished my uh, high school career at Sarah. That's what's up, man. I know uh, we're both from LA, but yeah. you're a little more south than I am. <laughs> you know, I'm happy to be a little from the north side, but uh, <laughs> You know, I heard there's a lot of good players from, from where you're from, man. Let's try to speak on that, you know? Uh, yeah, we got a couple of great players out there. Um, I actually went to school with uh, one of the players we played against this weekend, mm -hmm. uh, Paul Richardson. Oh, that's right. He's a beast. Yeah. yeah. Um, uh, I went to school with Robert Woods. Mm -hmm. uh, not Ladies only did I go to high school, I went to college with him. Um, Benet Ben Wickery. Okay. Uh, he actually with Dallas right now. So uh, we got a couple people out there. You, you know guys, what I'm man. I think y'all not putting up as much as the Valley is, but you know, y'all oh, y'all doing y'all thing, man. Y'all doing Valley thing. is very broad. <laughs> <laughs> we know, you know, you know, you you do a lot of special things, but we know you do sign language. So we hope you can do something for sign language for us and, and tell us what it, what you did. Okay, sign language. Uh, you guys put me on the spot. Um, okay, I'm gonna have to spell it out. Okay. What'd you say? We're going to win. <laughs> you heard it here first. There you go, Marquise Lee sign language. Appreciate that. Well, now that we know you do sign language, what, what about off the field? What other off the field things do you do? Um, for the most part, uh, in all honesty, I just like to chill, man. Mm -hmm. um, I don't do too much. Um, chill with the family. Mm -hmm. I'm big at barbecues and uh, playing dominoes. Mm -hmm. um, I'm big at that. Uh, but other than that, um, that's really about it. I yeah. might step out here and there, but other than that, nothing too, nothing too crazy. I feel you, man. You gotta, you gotta work. We're here to work. So you're here to work, get your body right, rest, and then uh, come do a great job out here. That's I it. I feel you, man. We'll, we'll get together in LA, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll see each other, we'll hang out. <laughs> so we know, you know, last year you had a great year, and this year you're having an even better year. What's this, what's changed from last year to this year to you to put you where you are? Um, whew. Um, just a mindset, mm -hmm. for the most part. Um, um, I'm big on uh, just staying positive regardless of what situation I'm in. Um, and as you can see, as far as this year, we was in a crazy situation with Hearns and A-Rob going down. Mm -hmm. um, um, but then I just got a lot of uh, great friends around me, mm -hmm. you know, who, uh, who, uh, who keep me going for the most part. Rob, for mm -hmm. the most part, continue to talk to him all day, every day. Um, keep me on a positive, you know, straight line. So at the end of the day, I'll be, I'll be chilling, man. Yeah. So uh, I don't stress. I think that's the key to it. Yeah. It's uh, stress free. You stress, uh, you tend to do bad. Uh, you stress free, things tend to go well. I feel you. I, I like to say you have to be uncomfortably comfortable. You know, just go out here and do your thing. You know, you're a baller. You just go out there and do your thing. Everything's gonna fall in place. That's it. You know, so. No, I, honestly. I feel you, man. Thanks for coming on, big dog. You Appreciate know, you, man. Thanks for hanging out with us today on the Jackson Five. See you guys next week. <laughs>